everybody, we're here at the movie theater, ready to come and see the Super Mario Bros. movie. Hope that you guys enjoyed today, and hope that you guys are able to watch the movie. And, uh, we're going to record a review on the movie, so that you guys know how well it does. And like, subscribe, and share. Hi everyone, and welcome to the Super Mario Bros. Movie Review. Here to talk about the whole movie to all Mario fans and to all Nintendo fans. This movie has a lot of references to tons and tons of Nintendo games ever since the 60s, the 80s, you name it. They made references to almost all of the video games. Here's one thing I'll say about it. You don't see a lot of Yoshi. And this movie, I would say, is super duper hilarious. I mean, you go from Bowser singing to then, to then like the Donkey Kong battle where whenever it introduces Donkey Kong, it has the DK rap. And during the battle, you do see Donkey Kong use his Super Smash Bros. abilities. There are Mario Odyssey references as to Mayor Pauline being in the movie. And just also because the movie has Mario and Luigi starting off in Brooklyn. So I'm not going to spoil anything, but I'm just going to tell you just only part of the beginning. Which is um, where it introduces Mario and Luigi in Brooklyn. They get to the Mushroom Kingdom. And then... Uh, <laughs> Mario meets Toad and Princess Peach, and I'm not gonna say everything else, but I mean, if this movie is, you you just want to see it. Now you do get to see the power ups, as in like the mushroom. Uh, now you don't see the Yoshi egg, but you do see the fire flower, obviously the star. You, you do see coins. You do see the ice flower. You do see um the mini mushroom. Obviously, there's a Mario Kart references in there, as in, like, Rainbow Road, um, like, the whole Kong family. I mean, Bowser has to be at least one of the most funniest characters, as in, uh, him singing to himself, and thinking, and just trying to practice him asking Princess Peach to marry him. <laughs> Obviously, there's like a Duck Hunt reference, there's a um, Mike Tyson Punch-Out reference, um, obviously Donkey Kong. Now, you do actually hear the actual voice of Mario. What, what I meant by that is uh, the actor or the voice actor who used to play Mario in all the video games. You do hear him in the very beginning and at the very end of the movie. Now one part that is funny is the Luma from Mario Galaxy, the blue one, who is really happy to die. <laughs> and whenever he doesn't, he's like, boo. <laughs> and I also like how they add baby Mario and baby Luigi into the movie. Obviously, it isn't meant to be Mario and Luigi's kids, it's just meant to be Mario as a kid and Luigi as a kid. You do see baby Peach, but you don't see like Rosalina in the movie. This movie is probably has to be one of the best video game movies in my opinion. It's like the number one uh, video game movie. Then second would have to be the Sonic movie. And uh, yeah, hopefully they're able to make a second one. And that would be really cool to introduce uh, Warrior and Willow EG. That would be really awesome. But all I'd like to say is like, subscribe, and share. And try and watch the movie. Uh, the, this movie, you, you'll you'll laugh a lot. I, I promise. This is a very funny movie. It's gonna be a very fun movie, especially to watch with friends and family. Try and watch it now. Uh, yeah, <laughs> go watch the movie. This movie was really amazing. Um, going to, uh, it had some of the video game music, I mean, this was a really good job by Nintendo, I would say, 
it, it was just the best movie I've probably ever seen. I mean, this movie was really, really incredible. Um, obviously the music, the video game references, them starting off in Brooklyn. Uh, this was a very funny movie too. Um, I would go see it and like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye.